It isn't department against department. There's no fake battles going on. It's your whole organization potentially against an outside competitor, but maybe just against its personal best or its previous best. Well, let me ask you the question. How do dogs greet one another? <laughs> that's right, they're butt sniffers. Now imagine the chaos that we would enter into if that's the way we greeted one another as we came into the office. Hmm. So dogs do that to discover friends and foe, right? What ends up happening though is that as humans we rely on our sense of sight. So you'll notice even in a room like this, chances are you've made eye contact with a good proportion of all the people in the room. And so what's interesting then is that your brain is constantly trying to decide who's like me and who's not like me. Someone at some point in your life told you you were capable of doing something that you weren't. What I really feel sorry for is the people who've never been told that, that they've always been told that they're no good or they'll never be successful. I hate that negative brainwashing. I'm not suggesting you go home if it's your husband or wife and saying, look, turns out you are an aggressive prick. I learned today in the workshop that the problem isn't me. Just because you look at someone else and see their great car or their great house or whatever it is and you think, my goodness, that person's so successful, there's something called credit you know, that's available. I, I, when, when I had all the toys, I had big lines of credit, okay? So let's stop being envious because I think that if you want, if you see someone else and you really like what they've got, realize that you're gonna have to swap the whole package. You're gonna have to take the good stuff and bad stuff that comes from, with them and you're gonna have to swap them for your good stuff and your bad stuff together. So at the end of the day, the grass isn't really much greener. I made a series of mistakes and at the time my marriage was not as robust as it should have been and I was blaming my wife. I didn't have enough revenue and I was blaming my clients. I was having trouble paying the bills so I blamed my suppliers and my bankers. But you know there was one person at the scene of all of those crimes. Me. For some of you, this is going to be like being hit in the head with a piece of wood, two by four. Because I'm going to confront you on some of the things that you think make you successful that are actually working against you. This is we want our managers acting in, in leadership to have a picture of where they'd like to see the department go, the division, the institution the organization. And does the manager know for sure that this picture that they have of the future is a certainty? No. And yet they have to step out in faith, believing in something better than exists right now. Picture's worth a thousand words, right? If the picture's worth a thousand words, you gotta download it through this inefficient uh, device called your mouth. I mean, you gotta talk really quickly in order to get your message out. In fact, you're seeing pictures. The pictures are like popping up in your head. You gotta use your hands to talk. I mean, you can't even talk fast enough. In fact, if you want a visual person to kind of talk slower, just make them sit on their hands for a while. They will not be able to talk. Because of the pictures, you gotta be able to draw the pictures. I mean, you're fast talking, right? You need to make things happen. Quick, 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 quick. My daughter will come home and she'll say, Dad, at school today, we did worked on a project. That was kind of neat. Because, you know, we were doing a science experiment. It's like, are you asking me questions? <laughs> or are you making a statement? You know, we're here to energize ourselves. Wow, it's so good to be here. And like, the visuals be like, yeah, I'm with that guy. I'm like that. <laughs> Meanwhile, the kinesthetics are going, ooh, he's one of those fast talkers. <laughs> I should have stayed at home with the tools in the workshop. Just because you're the leader does not make you a genius. Please realize that for those of you, half the crowd raised their hands. You know what? Just because you're the boss doesn't mean you're the smartest 
the person who has to make all the tough decisions, you know what? It's probably a hair's difference between why you're in the position and somebody else isn't. However, if you'd like to know what the Jedi mind trick is, it's command inflection. You're really enjoying the seminar, aren't you? <laughs> now, you could probably use this technique at the office tomorrow. You want to go and buy me a coffee, don't you? <laughs> These are not the droids you're looking for. These are not the reports you're looking for. Ooh, ooh, I've got yet another great idea. I can't believe how many I come up with, but here's a gem. Meanwhile, the quiet person has really thought it through. They have a great idea. Nobody wants to listen to them. When I went through this assessment five years ago, it was so crucial for you to like me. Today, I only half care if you like me, okay? And, and I say that realistically because I need you to change. We know all of the screw-ups we do, because we're involved in them. Other people, our boss only has half an idea of all the mistakes we make. You know, and probably it's best that way, right? If you think it's your gift, that God's given you the gift to find fault, I want you to realize that you might want to return that gift. Because we all have the ability to see the fault in others. Why oppositional people are defensive is, by picking on the fault of you, I keep you from picking on my faults. As you help other people on that journey, as they take a step up and you've encouraged them, you will be rewarded for that. You need to know that, you'll be rewarded. And so I just ask that you use what we've talked about and make a positive difference in the people around you. You can do it and I'm confident in your abilities.